Hi everyone and welcome to the Idaho Rivers United River Rats video on the basics of public comment. My name is Ren and today we're going to focus on giving you a basic overview of public comment, what it is, why it's important, and how you can get involved. It's a really impactful way that anyone can get involved in the rulemaking process, especially in environmental policy and conservation issues. So first of all, what is public comment? Well, public comment is a designated period of time during which agencies seek input from citizens on a proposed policy. It's built into the rulemaking process. It's an opportunity for you to weigh in and give feedback on proposed policies and to help hold our agencies accountable in the rules that they make surrounding our natural resources. So exactly what role does it play in the rulemaking process? Well, this visual from the public comment project is the simplest explanation I have found of the role that public comment plays in the rulemaking process. Basically, once a policy is drafted and released to the public, the public has an opportunity to respond. Comments that meet the criteria of substantive must be considered in the final rulemaking process. We'll talk a little bit more about what that criteria is in another video. So what happens to public comments? Well, first of all, they become a part of the public record. It builds a documentation of input and responses to the policy early on in the rulemaking process. This can be instrumental in holding agencies accountable and pointing out flaws, strengths, weaknesses, missed data or research, or alternatives that should be considered in the policy. Without this record of early involvement, though, and concerns in the rulemaking process, it becomes extremely difficult to hold agencies accountable for actions and decisions later on. It really is the first step that citizens can take in making sure that appropriate policies are developed and that our natural resources are appropriately protected and managed. So how can you give a public comment? Typically, public comment is given in two ways, verbal and written. Verbal public comments are given at a public hearing surrounding that policy. You're typically allotted two to three minutes, and it's a good idea for you to write your comments out ahead of time and to bring a written copy of your comments that you can turn in after you give your comment. That way you can make sure that you're recorded in public record in the way that you truly want to be heard. Written public comment is typically submitted through email or through an online form. If you visit the agency website or go to regulations.gov, which is the federal regulation database, you'll find information on how to submit your written comment. It's important that you pay close attention to the directions when submitting your comments to ensure that your comments will be considered and received. Oftentimes, conservation organizations that work on the issues that you care about will be able to provide information, direction, and guidance on how to make comments on proposed public policies. On the Idaho Rivers United website, we have resources to try to make this process simple and accessible for you as a part of our river advocacy training program, also called River Rats. So subscribe to our emails as well to get regular updates on issues and public comment opportunities. Thank you so much for tuning in and check out our other River Rats resources so that you can learn more about how you can get involved in environmental policy.